My attempts to support our energy supply with wood or self-produced biogas during periods of low sunshine made my Stirling generators more and more complex. The relatively new concept of the thermoacoustic Stirling engine is a radical simplification of the Stirling cycle. Movable mechanical components are only required to utilize the thermoacoustic energy generated, which greatly increases reliability and endurance characteristics. In the last two videos, I presented the thermoacoustic Stirling engine and showed the production of the first required parts. Now, all that was missing was a regenerator and a few little things and I could finally start the first test run. Of course, I also had to deal with setbacks and problems. At first, I carried out initial tests with provisional setups. After I manufactured a proper power extraction unit and made several changes to the feedback loop, the regenerator and the general settings, I finally had my first successful test run. The first big step has been taken, a working prototype on which I can gain practical experience. Of course, the power output is not high with such a small and simple machine, but I can experiment with what with what brings more performance to plan the next more powerful engine. I have a lot of improvements planned and I'm already thinking about a larger version. The next engine will probably be another low pressure borosilicate glass machine with a larger volume to study the differences and effects of the changes. I also have to delve deeper into the complex thermoacoustic salary to be able to plan changes successfully. Before I carry out further test runs, I would like to measure the thermoacoustic and mechanical performance using pressure sensors, frequency measurements and a linear generator in order to be able to carry out meaningful optimization tests. I don't yet know which type of linear generator is best suited for this. If you have any suggestions as to which linear generator offers advantages or how I can improve the thermoacoustic Stirling engine, please write them in the comments. Many thanks for watching.